Oh my god, he's down. I'm working with Karen and her high energy Himalayan Persian Mr. Weasley. As I'm showing her proper playing techniques, Mr. Weasley suddenly collapses. I'm really worried. Yeah. He's never Let's... been like this before. <gasps> Let's get this cat to a vet, like now. Okay, copy that. Weasley is responsive, but he's drooling a little bit on the floor. He's clearly in distress. What do you mean, one second? It's not a good scene. Whatever the nearest hospital is, we're getting him in. There is, I know, I know there's, there's this one here. Hey, Jessica, we got a place. How's, they're asking how his breathing is. It's shallow. Here, yeah. I got it. Let's go. We're not dealing with the rest of this Let's go. I've never seen him drop like that. Just, just drop. The wobbling, like he was like drunk almost. He's never yeah. done that either. That's it's not right. normal at no. all. Now he's panting again right now. I hope it's not his heart, man. Here it is, to the right. I know this to be a great hospital. I know that he's in good hands, but I'm scared. They don't want cameras in here. They don't want to be filmed. They want to do what they do. They want to be a hospital. I want to make sure that they put this cat through every possible test. So they're going to give him a heart check. They're also going to do the blood test, and they're going to do a chest x-ray. We got a real competent doctor in there. He seems optimistic. So that was reassuring. Good. I don't think anybody has played with more cats on the face of this planet than me, and I have never played with a cat who has collapsed mid-play. And now we just wait. I'm freaked out right now. I'm actually really freaked out right now because I've been worried about him from the beginning with the panting, but this today just ramped it up for me, and now I feel like a nervous, overprotective parent. So we heard from the vet a few hours later, and they didn't find anything seriously wrong with Mr. Weasley. Maybe a little bit of asthma, but that's it. So now they're going to send his x-rays and scans to a radiologist to get his opinion, but we can take Mr. Weasley home as long as we keep him calm. Mr. Weasley! Weasley! Why do you have to freak us out so I bad? Know. Welcome home. So as we get back to Karen's, the stakes might actually be the highest they've ever been for what I assigned for homework. I can't take any risks with Mr. Weasley's health.